So uh, that's a real special project that we uh, managed to, uh, to get access to uh, with FC Barcelona. It's something that was never done before by any other um, prestigious football club or um, I have never heard of even any other sporting club that did something like that. And the idea was that um, we offer the possibility to each player in the team to actually design his, uh, his own piece. Um, so uh, we presented the project to uh, FC Barcelona and um, they thought it was a really cool idea and they had never done that before. So they handled it internally and gave us access, this special access to the players. And uh, then we had some one-to-one -one sessions with each player and each player could decide on colors, on finishings, on cases. And we set up a whole design studio within the training facilities of FC Barcelona. So, uh, yeah, really, literally, uh, we, we brought the Maurice Lacroix universe down to Barcelona and we set up a whole a real design studio. And uh, so when they walked in, they were really quite amazed and surprised to, to see uh, what was going on here. Obviously, it's an experience that none of them had ever done to sit down and design a watch and uh, obviously they all like watches and cars and uh, you know uh, so it was actually really fun for them and obviously you have different personalities you know you have those that are a bit intimidated and shy and then those that are super enthusiastic and uh, that don't want to get up they just want to try every possible option and uh, write different engravings on the side and try it out. The model they had as a base to work on was the Pontos S Extreme which is a very interesting piece because of its alloy uh, that we use to produce the case. So it's uh, an alloy that we call uh, Paralite, which is um, an alloy of five different materials. And um, it's an aluminium base, so uh, thanks to that we can also uh, give it some special colors and color the, the actual material. And yeah, so the players were given that piece as a base. They could choose some uh, colors for the case. They could choose if they wanted a matte finishing or a polished finishing for the case. They could choose uh, the colors of the, of the straps, of the stitching on the straps, the dials of the, um, of the hands, many little details on the piece they could actually really uh, um, try out. Because we, had, we developed a special app. Um, so um, uh, whilst we were doing the design sessions, they could, uh, so we had lots of samples on the table of materials, of movements, of cases and all that. But then they could also play with, uh, with this app and see real time how their, what their watch would actually look and uh, make some tests and uh, that was really actually quite fun. But on the side of the watch, each player could engrave a message or his name or the name of his son or whatever, his favorite number. So each, that's another customization op option which they had. So it's 24 different watches, each of them unique and each of them with the really uh, individual touches of, of, of each player. The project was called Unique Players Watch. So obviously we only produced one piece of these watches for the players. Then we have now uh, second collection which is not sellable, it's a kind of a museum collection that we're going to use now to do a world tour exhibition and present uh, the collection in different markets across uh, Asia, Europe, the States. It's a big commitment obviously, we signed for three years with them. And obviously because of the awareness of FC Barcelona it's, it enables us to have a global campaign which is uh, relevant to most of our markets. It's really providing us a lot of uh, visibility and uh, hopefully going to help the brand to, to, to gain awareness.